Hey folks, welcome to Concept. In today's video, we will learn about option writing, wherein we will understand what option writing is and how can we go ahead and write options with an edge. So to quickly understand what is option writing, so over here what we do is we actually go ahead and sell call option and put option. They can be of same strike price or they can be of different strike price. So the idea behind uh, selling call and put option is something like this that uh, I'm selling, let's say, put option. This is the red color line is what the payoff will look like. If I sell a call option, this, the green color line is how the payoff will look like. Now, every passing day, some premium will be killed by theta. Okay, so eventually, if I want to write options, this is something what I want to typically leverage on, which is theta. So if I sell both call and put, let's say, 100, 100 rupees today, okay? Call I sold at 100, put I sold at 100. Let's imagine that all the conditions in the market remain the same and market the next day it opens let's say at the same level implied volatility is at the same level so what will happen is some premium will be decayed from the 100 100 rupees call and puts let's say the premium happens to be 80 on call and 80 on put so that 40 rupees which has decayed from call and put that is basically my profit that is what i am looking out to actually churn from the market that is something what i am looking out to benefit from the market now is it that simple? Because if it was that simple, everybody would have uh, came to options and eventually just would have sold options randomly, right? Because time is something which is going to decay. So we know don't need to predict that at all, correct? If I want to write options, then one thing which I which will be in my favor is time. So I don't need to predict that because I know that the time will do its job and it will automatically decay my premium. Okay. So now what else I need if I want to write options? So first thing is, only theta is something what may not make me money. Okay, understand the statement carefully that if I want to write options and if I want to make money. Hey traders, Quantsap has simplified option trading analytics for you. Click the link in the description box below, complete your sign up process and access the most advanced option analytical tools in the entire industry. Thank you. Only theta may not make me money. I need to focus on other factors as well. So coming to the other factors, one of the first factors is that I want the underlying to remain sideways, okay? And I want the probable range in which the underlying might uh, move due to which I can select the strikes and I can sell the strikes accordingly. What I mean is, let's say if I'm placed on this day and if I want to write options, I should be able to forecast that this is, let's say, on Nifty, let's say, uh, 150 points upwards movement is what I expect and on the other hand 200 points downward movement is what I expect while I'm writing options on this day. Okay. Now the scenario while doing this is that I will be knowing in advance that okay I need to sell the call strike slightly closer but I need to sell the put strike which is a bit far away. Right. So first thing that we need is range forecasting. We should be able to forecast that, okay, typically this is where the market might move or this is the range in which market might move. Okay. Now, what is the next step? The next step is, I got the range. Now, what should I do? Which strike to write? Okay. Should I write uh, 19,800? Should I write 20,000? Should I write 9,900? What strike price option should I write? So, the next thing what I want is optimize strike selection. The strike should be able to beat my forecast and make me man. Okay, with a good reward to risk. See, when we talk about option writing, the reward is very limited, but the risk is undefined. So whenever I'm writing options, so I need to make sure that I'm trading on a better reward to risk. Okay, so I should make money at least how much I'm losing. That means if I'm losing 1000 rupees, I should make at least 1000 or 1200 or even if it is more than it is better. Right, so what I want is basically I want the reward to risk. To be amplified to get improvised in my favor okay so this is the third thing now last thing is i want that other factors in the market should focus my trade should uh, you know favor my trade something like time decay something like implied volatility they all should favor me now doing all of these things manually may be uh, a little bit complicated so for that we have a very simple analytic which is named as option like so if i want to write options I'll just open option writer and that's it. So the tool will automatically show us. Okay. So first of all, select the instrument in which we want to write the option. Let's say I'll select Nifty. 
so expiry select the expiry in which we need to write option so let's say 19 to october now if you see the range indicator so it is asking us what is the indicator that you want to select in order to option writer to mark the range of the market okay so concept indicator actually accounts for the recent most behavior of the instrument and uh, you know it actually shows more realistic range in which the market might gyrate okay so over here if you see it is showing total 260 points is the range of uh, you know the highest point to the lowest point current market price is 19842 so what it is trying to say is on the lower side the lower band is 19700 and the upper band is 19970 okay so this is how we can forecast the range easily only thing we need to do is come to concept range indicator and select you know concept indicator if i want to write options based on bollinger band i can do that too okay so now how does how do how will this thing work is so the upper band of the bollinger okay that would be my upper level and the lower band of the bollinger would be my lower level but the problem with bollinger bands is that the two standard deviations might get too big okay and uh, you know they say that 95 percentage of data will fall under two standard deviation so probably i will not make decent return because the the band would be very spread it it would be very you know wide so i don't want a strategy which will not make me money at all so imagine market at 19800 i can still go ahead and sell 21000 and i on the lower side i can still go ahead and sell uh, you know 19000 so still that strategy will make me money but how much money it will make imagine it would be negligible premium for which i will be taking an undefined loss so the idea is for me to actually make money not just the range that the range should not be so big that i may not end up making money but if it is too small again it will get risky so concept indicator is uh, you know my favorite for that where it actually accounts for all these things what we just discussed and gives us more realistic range now strike selection again over here the strike selection is optimized over here for this range these are the best strike prices which we can go ahead and write so we will get to see what are the strike prices typically we should write premium inflow how much inflow we are uh, getting on one lot target profit okay so if market remains here it is or maximum how much profit we might make is shown to us by this stop loss if either of these levels are achieved either market goes at 19970 or market hits here okay 19700 so roughly 476 rupees is the loss that i might book over here writing attractiveness how lucrative this trade is to write so it is indicated by these signals red signals indicate obviously that these parameters are not in your favor the green signal indicates that these parameters are in our favor trend score yellow that means the instrument is mildly trending moderately trending it is not aggressively trending gamma risk as of now uh, we are ahead or far away from the expiry so there is no gamma risk as such theta speed as we are far away from the expiry the theta speed is uh, uh, really really slow now talking about ivp and ivr the ivs are at lower level so that is the reason it is highlighting in red okay so if i see let's say three uh, green signals out here then it will basically eventually you know what will happen is it will increase my conviction to go ahead and write options for this particular trade so only thing i need to do is just come to option writer and just select the script and i can write options easily now if i want to write for two days from here okay that means if i sell today and if i hold it for the next two days so what would be the strategy how much should be the range so everything would be shown in option writer now these strike prices are optimized but if i add a hedge then the hedge is not optimized the reason is because every trader will have a different risk appetite so we can actually go ahead and adjust the hedges accordingly so if i want to write overnight i will typically prefer the strategies where you know i am hedging but still if i am doing it intraday then they should be all right for me for that if i analyze i get to see on, on what day at what time how much pnl i might expect from this strategy last thing is if i want to set any sorts of alerts so i can do that before i click execute okay so it will ask me for alert profit alert after how much profit i want a uh, notification so it would be on mobile application of concept and telegram if we have like so if i want to trade profit even that is possible so basically the moment i enter the trade i can easily manage that too
Okay, so using option writer, we can write options easily. So what we actually accounted by doing this, we accounted for the trend, we accounted for the optimized strike selection. We actually checked if the Greeks or if the variables are uh, suitable for us to write options. And last thing that we did was actually to check if we are making money in the option writing trade or not. And if we actually initiate, we can obviously set alerts wherein we can manage the trades efficiently. So the link is there in the description box below. Unlock option writer and write options with an edge.